is day 70 on Turkesterone. YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name is Jason. Here on this channel, I do food and product reviews and Turkesterone reviews. Day 70, like I said, so this is week 10. I'm taking Turkesterone. I've been taking Black Forest for most of the time, and I also was taking, did several weeks of Gorilla Mines. So, if you're new here, this is just a weekly update, not so much a review of Turk, even though, I mean, kind of, but more of how Turk has changed me and how I felt on Turk, and is it working? You know, so I can just come out and do a one week thing and be like, hey, Turk is great, but how does it affect you over the long run? Like I said, this is day 70 on it, so we'll get into, you know, my weight, pictures, how I feel, what's been going on this week. So, Let's first, just for those of you new, and I've gotten comments like, dude, you talk too much. You just get to the, get to the, the review. But like I said, this isn't really a review. If you wanna know, I'll just get right to it. Does Turk work? Yes. It works for me. Will it work for you? You can go through all my videos. There's what, 10 of them now. It may or may not, and you can watch other guys. You can watch Coach Greg. You can watch Jesse James West, you know, it's, and they'll probably say it too in their videos. It, it, Turk works for some people and Turk work may not work for others. There's just not a lot of research out there on Turk yet. For me, it has made changes. I feel it and I've said it before, it's along the lines of creatine. Yes, it's kind of like a plant-based steroid, but you're not gonna get major results like you would from say actual steroids. Think of it along the lines of creatine. That's what you're kind of gonna get is results that you get from creatine which is still great. So if you're taking creatine, then you take Turk, you get a little extra. All right, so just get that out of the way for the new people. For the rest of you who've been following this journey, I sit here every week and tell you, hey, Turk's been working, I'm seeing results, I'm feeling a difference. And I know I read the comments, people are like, oh, that's because, you know, he's getting pills from say Black Force, whatever. So of course he's gonna tell you it works. Well, don't just take my word from it. I've pulled out some comments from the videos of some of you who've been seeing results. So let's go ahead and read some of these. So it's not just my word that Turk is working. These guys are feeling it too. Okay, first, uh, Christian, and if I murder your name, I apologize. Giron, Girona, Girona? However you pronounce that, you can see it there. I bought Black Forest because of you. Thank you, seriously. Thank any of you that have gone and bought it because of me, and I hope you get results from it. I've taken Turk Builder before and I felt like I got results. Like just going to the gym felt amazing. I most, I mostly to strength training, so I like to lift heavy stuff. The Turk Builder, I was taking six pills at max. I slowly transitioned to, I apologize, some of these are tough to read. Turk, the Turk Builder I was, I was taking six pills at max. I slowly transitioned to six pills. That was a couple months ago. Then I started taking Black Forest and I'm on my third week. First week I started with one, then the second week on I've been taking two pills. It's crazy because as long as I've been strength training, my squats have never felt great like it has been the last couple weeks. My deadlift and bench have also felt great, but the squats has just shot up in numbers. I still get amazing feeling when going to the gym. My food intake has mostly been the same and the program I'm on, I started way before I started to take Black Forest. Yesterday I squatted 518 for one rep. Where did that, where, where I did that a few months ago, I barely got it up, but when I did 518 yesterday, it flew. So I'm going to say it was the Turk, but it had something to do with it. I'm, I'm, no, I'm not going to say it was the Turk, but, I, but it had something to do with it. Even when I was on Turk Builder, my squats didn't feel as amazing as they do right now. Using Black Forest without throwing down six pills at a day is so good because those bottles are going to go quick. It's nice to take two pills with Black Forest. Sorry for such a long story. I just wanted to express my experience with Black Forest. Your videos are awesome. Keep up the great work, bro. Have a good day, bro. Thank you, Christian. Sorry, I kind of murdered what you wrote there a little bit, but no, that's what he's saying is, he was taking Turk Builder. He was having to take six pills, not really seeing the results that he's seeing on, what do you see on two pills of Black Forest? Again, this claims to be stronger. 
I've told you, I felt more on this with less than I felt taking more on Gorilla Mines. And again, last I've checked, like $60 for these, for 60 pills. Um, I think this was right around $30 for 60 pills over here. You take less, that six, that $30, this, this bottle here. So let's say you only had to take two. I'm taking four right now. I took two for a while, still saw great results. So I would recommend if you start off, maybe start with one for a few weeks and then go to two. It just depends, um, however you feel. So let's say you're just taking two of this. This will last you a month, 60 pills in here, one month for $30. We're over here with uh, Gorilla Mines, for me at least, to see to feel the same stuff. When I was taking four, I still wasn't feeling quite what I was feeling over here. I'd need a couple bottles of these. That's like a, let's say I was gonna take four. I'd have to get two bottles. That's $120 compared to $30. So there's a price difference. So that was Christian's story. Mr. Degree at Jason Mazurk. And again, I will pronounce it for you because someone did a video and they called me Jason Maverick. Whatever, okay, cool, I'm a Maverick. I text my daughter, I'm like, apparently we've been saying her name wrong this whole time. We're the Mavericks, not the Mazurks. It's Jason Mazurk. Jason Mazurek is not lying. Strength gains for real, for real. I'm guessing this is what that FRFR is. I tried Coach Greg's and two other brands. Black Forest is better in my opinion, but you should try it. Exactly. You know, we can all sit here and they can write comments and I can tell you it's great stuff. You don't know until you try it, you know. Again, it's not gonna work the same for everyone. That goes along with almost anything out there, you know. Everybody gets different results from anything it is, you know. I may love Papa John's pizza. You may hate it. I may think it's the greatest pizza in the world. You may think it's the worst. We all react differently to things. So you don't know until you try it. So, and again, it's cheap. It doesn't cost an arm and leg to try it out. So that was Mr. Gree. Thank you, Mr. Gree. All right, Big Diesel. Let's check out what Big Diesel has to say. I appreciate your honesty. I'm trying Black Forest for about two weeks now, and I do one pill in the morning and two in the afternoon before my workout. To be honest with you, I jumped from 225 pound flat bench press for four sets, 15 reps, to 255, four sets, 15 reps. Incline, 205 to 230, same set, same reps. Decline, 255 to 295, 255, 10 to 12 reps, and 295, five reps. No bull, I'm being straight up honest. Big Diesel is being honest with you. I'm being honest with you. I'm not here to lie to you about this stuff. I'm very amazed. I tried ectosterone first. It did okay, but not like this. My leg press went up. My stamina is up. My sleep is better. I dream a lot too. Laugh out loud, crazy. But I'm very impressed with Black Forest. I'm almost out, so I'll be ordering more of this, thinking about going to four pills a day, just just to see if it makes a difference from three to four a day. Maybe see how it works with just one after that. And that's what I've been saying, you know, I'm doing four, I think I'll do a couple months and then maybe I'll drop down to one to see, is there a huge difference from being on four to dropping down to one? It's a big diesel. We're thinking alike there, bro. Oh, uh, where was I? See how it works with just one. Also after the next bottle, I, uh, and see if it decline, see a decline it will go up to three. Or, so if he sees a decline, he'll go back up to three or four again. I also stack with L-leucine and creatine after my workouts, followed by a protein shake. I consume about 200 grams of protein a day, D3 magnesium, magnesium K2, and I take zinc and boron hours later before bed, and I'm growing big time. I will order from your channel link for the support. The next bottle is Big Diesel. Sign it out, brother. Keep up the updates coming. Thank you. Thank you, Big Diesel. Exactly, you know, that's what I've been saying. I'm gonna kind of jump around. I'm doing four for a couple months. Then maybe I'll drop down to one and see if there's a huge difference. Um, if there is, then I'll probably go back up to four. I don't know if I would do six. Again, like I've said it in other videos, my plans change all the time. We'll see when we get there. So like I said, don't just take my word for it. Read the comments, you know. I, obviously there's gonna be comments down there. People like, oh, Turk is, doesn't work. It's a placebo. Well, one, most likely a lot of those people have never tried it. Or, you know, how long were you on it and how many pills were you taking? And again, like I've said a thousand times, not everybody reacts to it the same. Again, if you wanna pick up Black Forest, I have a link down in the description. I'm not sponsored, sponsored by them. They don't 
pay me, like, hey, make some of these videos, which I think some of these other big names do. Yes, I'm sure that they have links, I know that, but I'm sure they're paid per video too. Could be why some of these cost so much more. They're paying for advertising. Um, yes, I make a very small proportion off if you buy it off my link, and it helps me out. It means a lot. So again, if you do buy from my link, thank you, thank you very much. And again, keep those stories coming. Um, I wanna know how you feel on Black Forest, you know, because it helps other people, because a lot of people are like, oh, this isn't real, it's too cheap, it can't be as strong as they say, this can't be better than these major brands. These guys got Jesse James West, they got Coach Greg, they got big names pushing them. I, I don't know how many people are out there pushing other than me, I'm not a big name. I'm a very, very, very tiny, tiny, little tiny YouTuber but I'm seeing great results. I'm feeling really good on it, and clearly a lot of you are too, so keep those stories coming. Let me know, how do you feel on Black Forest? Or maybe you're taking some other turk, let me know how you're feeling on that too. So if you follow along with me, you know, uh, with the updates last week, I was on, um, not this last week, the week prior, uh, Gorilla Mines, and it didn't go so well. So this, this last week, I've been on, Black on, back on Black Forest. It's early still. Um, four pills. Feeling better. Uh, workouts. You know, I think it's going to take a, probably another week to really get that. You know, get my system back up to where I was on here. Um, but the workouts were great. Uh, got up at 6 a.m. today, and I was. I didn't go to the gym because I have a busy day. That's another Tuesday. It's usually I go to the gym and do chest, back, and shoulders, and I was like, God so much going on today, I don't have time. Because the gym's like 15 minutes away, so I'm like, that's a half hour drive, and go there, and a locker, and all that stuff. I can just work out here, and work out my apartment gym here, and, and get it done a lot faster, or save time. Time is money for me, I have a lot to do. So I worked out here, great workout, felt good. Um, Sunday was arm day, and I had pain again on Sunday. Not, and the pain was actually there before, and the pain is right here. And it, it was there before I even started working out. Not like super bad, but tender. And as I was lifting, and like I said, I've changed how I curl. I curl a lot less now, and I've used cables. A lot more careful. And not a whole lot of pain while I was doing it, but later that evening, it was just throbbing and hurting. I'm like frustrated. I'm like, what the heck? You know, what is going on? I, I've changed how I'm lifting. I've lowered weights. I was hoping this would help some, and then I'm thinking the next day, I'm like, what the heck happened? Why was I hurting prior to that? And I didn't even didn't even register until I started thinking about it. I drive a high-low at work, one of the stand-up ones. Not to sit down with a steering wheel, a stand-up version where I have basically a handle in this hand where you spin it, that depending on which way I spin it is how I turn. And over here, I have a joystick the buttons and everything. And this week has been crazy. I work at Sam's Club in the receiving. We've been super busy, like so many trucks. I get in there, there's so many trucks to unload. Don't even have time in the day or room to unload them all. So pretty much all week, and usually I'm not on the forklift that long because I get in at 7.30, we open at eight. We can't be out on the floor with our, our high lows after that time. So then I'm just on the dock. And once I fill up the dock, it's done. I'm, I'm pretty much off it most of the day. This week, I've been on that thing pretty much all day. The time I get in, the time I get out. And that's when I started thinking, like the whole day, I'm basically working a joystick over here. And that is working those muscles there. And like, that's why it was sore this week, lifting, because it's, it really had no rest. So I think I have a brace for it. I haven't been wearing it at work. So I think I'm gonna start, especially if we're busy like that, I'm gonna start wearing it and hopefully that helps. So it wasn't the lifting or anything, it's this damn joystick. Hopefully if this channel ever takes off, I won't have to do that anymore. I can just do YouTube videos for you. But that's probably long down the road and maybe never, ever, ever happen. Okay, so other than that, workouts were good this week. Feeling good, sleep has been better. Um, the dreams, I haven't had the dreams like I had a few weeks ago where I could, you know, they were super real, like everything that happened, like I mentioned, I think in last week's video or whatever, where conversations I had in the dreams were just like, 
a hundred percent legit lead I would have in in real life. So that may have had something to do with coming off the THC, but still sleeping really good. Like as soon as I get in bed, I'm, you know, I might play my phone, but as soon as I'm like, okay, I'm done. I put my head down. I'm out. I mean, I'm out quick, way faster than I ever did before I was on Turk. So that's awesome. Sleeping good. Um, dreaming a lot. So we'll see if there's any change in that as I stay on Black Forest and stop doing like real mines and stuff and just stay on this and see if there's any changes in there. Um, let's get to some photos. And while I'm bringing that up, you notice I have a lot of Star Wars stuff back here. Huge fan of Star Wars. Leave in the comments below. Did you watch the Obi-Wan series? The first two episodes? And what is your thoughts on it? Mine? It was decent. Um, wasn't blown away. But it was still good. Uh, just because I... I don't know if you've watched the, the animated series Star Wars Rebels. Let me keep going with the pictures while I'm talking to you. Um, I really loved the, the animated series uh, Rebels. And I really liked the Inquisitors. I just felt like, I don't know. I didn't like how they were portrayed in Obi-Wan Kenobi so far. And maybe that'll change as the series goes on. I just felt like they weren't as badass as they were in the animated series. Oh, I have two pictures here. The one is after, one week after taking Turk. I don't have a picture. Why I didn't take a picture at the very start, like before I even started taking Turk. So this is a week into Turk. I was taking, I believe at that time, two gorilla mines a day at that time. Um, right is today taking four um, Black Forest now. So clearly a difference. I know people are gonna say, well, it's newbie gains. I think there's a big difference there. I think that's uh, for 70 days of lifting. And if you go back prior to that, I've been lifting regularly uh, since last August. And I wasn't seeing that big of a transition from month to month, you know, from August to the time I started Turk. Yeah, I was losing weight, but that's on the left from August and let me see if I have that picture. So here's August. This is me in the start on the right. August to on the left to when I, you know, one week on Turk. Yes, I lost a lot of weight. Um, and clearly on the right, you can't see it. There is some muscle I had lifted in the past. I mean, it's just covered with fluffy chubby, chub chub. Um, so once I got rid of all that extra, excess weight, because I was 184 there. I think on the left, I was about 150, mid 150s, 155, 156, I believe, around that time. So I'd lost quite a bit of weight. So has Turk helped? Yes. I think it's added some. I think I've made more gains while well on Turk. But honestly, man, if you would have told me from that fluffy guy to that, in basically nine months to make that big of a transition. Uh, if you just told me back then, like, dude, like I used to dream about having a body like this. Never thought I would achieve it. Never thought I would work out daily, put in the effort. Um, so yeah, it's crazy. And we'll see, you know, that's, as those nine months, what will the next nine months be? I know it's there's not going to be that huge of a transition, you know, because, again, I know some of it is kind of newbie gains. It's me shedding a lot of fat, showing the muscle that – some of the muscle that I had underneath it, and then just working out a more. So I know from nine months from now, if I keep working out, hopefully there will be a difference. It won't be that big of a difference. But, you know, again, leave it in the comments below. Let me know your story. You know, how often do you work out? What – why are you working out? What are you trying to achieve? Me, it was, you know, my motivation was a breakup, trying to get even with my ex. Um, she called me fat, which I was, and a loser and shit when she broke up with me. And it was initially to get back at her. We've 
made we're not back together. We've made up. We're we're friends. We're on good terms now. Um, so that motivation's gone. Now it's um, just to look good and attract up attract other girls. You know, I don't want to. I man, when I see myself, when I look at old videos of me on YouTube, it, just go back a year or so or more and look at my. I just ugh, I don't like that person that I see anymore. Or then it just disgusts me. So I don't ever want to go back to that again. So. That's my motivation is not to look like that anymore. And I, man, like I said, when I get out of the shower and my mirror's right in front of me, I'm like, damn, I look good. And that is what I love. And yes, Turk has been helping. Like I said, it helps a little. It's kind of like creatine. It gives you a little extra boost. So I'm sorry if I ramble. I just like to tell you my stories, like to give you updates and tell you how I'm feeling, what I've been going through. Um, again, I love reading your comments. Let me know how you're doing. What, what are you feeling on it? And I will share more of those in future videos. Um, also, if you're interested, let me know in the comments below because I've got a lot of questions like, what do you eat? How's your diet? Do you take enough protein? Do you do this? Do you do that? Would you be interested in me doing like a, you know, a one-time video? I don't know. I don't know. It wouldn't be a series. Just kind of follow me along for the day of, you know, just videotape everything I eat. And I know um, I will get a lot of hate for it because I don't eat well. I eat to eat. Let me just give you a little background on my eating real quick. I'm not a big fan of one. I don't cook much. I can cook. I just kind of like why I didn't go to the gym day. I am, man, I have my day planned out. I don't have time to cook a lot. I may cook tacos every three or four weeks. That's pretty much it. That's my level of cooking. I mean, I yes, I can make burgers and steaks and all that stuff. I just I don't have time for that. I don't have I don't even have a kitchen table, like a dining room table, because I would never sit down and eat it. I have bar stools around my kitchen cupboard. I don't even sit in those. I make my food, I stand there, eat it, it's down. Like I eat really, really fast. I don't have time to sit and have meals. So I eat out of convenience, out of necess necessity. Um, so that's why my diet may not be like super great and you probably would hate on it, but it works for me right now. I monitor my weight every day and if it ever starts going up again, then I will adjust things. But for right now, it's what works for me. So if you're interested in that, um, obviously, I'm not going to take my camera to work with me. I, I mean, I'll show you what I take to lunch, um, but you know, I can, you know, videotape breakfast and my dinner and my protein shakes and all that stuff. So if you're interested in that, leave it down in the comments below. Let me know if that'd be something you'd want to see. Again, if you want to pick up Black Forest, I have a link down there. You can use that. It helps support me. If you don't, you can just go to blackforest.com and buy it that way, or you can buy any of these other Turks that you want. Support those creators. Just do what makes you happy. If you've enjoyed this video and you want to keep coming along with this journey, smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I'll see you next week. Or again, you know, I have other videos, food and product reviews. You can watch any of those. I'll see you next time.